please raise your hand if you have never forgotten a password. <laughs> yeah, remembering passwords is a challenge, and we have so many of them to access our bank, email, social media. Yes, from our personal devices, we can save our passwords. But to avoid unauthorized access to those saved passwords, we will need to have another password. And even if we use our fingerprint to unlock our devices, we still need a password setup in case the fingerprint reader simply decides not to work. Now, imagine if while typing your password, you couldn't see the keys or the screen to make sure you are typing your password in the password field. For more than 250 million people around the world who are blind or have low vision, that's how passwords have to be dealt with, with no visual cues or feedback. Considering these challenges, my research has two main focuses. The first is on understanding how people with vision impairment deal with passwords on a daily basis. For that, I conducted an online survey and collected answers from more than 300 people with vision impairment from 14 countries. I found that almost all of them acknowledge the importance of passwords, but more than half of them don't feel fully able to protect their digital information. In fact, 30% admitted they don't use any method to protect their smartphones from unauthorized access. Informed by the survey results, my second research purpose is on exploring a more tactile alternative for password input. Recently, a colleague here from Carlton investigated the use of a flexible uh, device uh, in which a sequence of gestures, such as band and fold, represented a band password. In her study with cited participants, she found that band passwords are more secure and as memorable as pins. My research will explore the potential of band passwords for people with vision impairment. I'm developing the flexible device pictured here, made of silicon and with flex sensors able to capture and verify band passwords. And I plan to evaluate how easy to learn and how easy to memorize band passwords are for people with vision impairment. My research is the first to explore band passwords for people with vision impairment. And I hope it will encourage the creation of more accessible methods to unlock devices. So in the future, everyone could feel fully able to protect their digital information. Thank you.